It's 10 trivia questions on descriptions of sports for listener Aaron Burgess. This is Trivia with Buds. Welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out my show yesterday. Big birthday shout out to my friend Wyatt. If you have something you want to shout out or you want to mold an episode around the loved one in your life, maybe uh, you have someone's birthday coming up or an anniversary and you guys listen to the podcast all the time, maybe do a shout out. Drop me a line, ryanbuds at gmail.com. Tell me what you got going on. I'll tell you how it all works and how we can make that happen for you, just like we did for Courtney and Wyatt. Today's episode, Descriptions of Sports, for Erin Burgess. She wanted an episode where we had a guest different sports based on a short description. So we'll see how everybody does on this quiz that we're doing for the first time ever. Before we do that, we have the Geek Out Challenge card. Name six actors who have played themselves in films. Six actors who have played themselves in films. For uh, television, two daytime soap operas. For books, four characters under the age of 10. And for music, six songs which reference a city in the lyrics. And your miscellaneous challenge, two franchises in which both vampires and werewolves appear. That's a fun one to close things out there. Okay, we're warmed up. We're ready to go. And we've got descriptions of sports coming up right now. Here we go. It's descriptions of sports. Number one, Joe Malone has the most goals scored in a single game. What sport is that? Number one, Joe Malone has the most goals scored in a single game. Number two, you can smash a shuttlecock, just don't carry it back court. What sport would that be? Number two, you can smash a shuttlecock, just don't carry it back court. Number three, Globo Jim is really good at this sport in a 2004 comedy film. Globo Jim is really good at this sport in a 2004 comedy film. Number four, 1986, white balls were changed to yellow so spectators could follow them easier on TV. 1986, white balls changed to yellow so spectators could follow them easier on TV. Number five, Daryl Dawkins shattered fiberglass for the first time in 1979. Daryl Dawkins shattered fiberglass for the first time in 1979. What sport is that? Number six, it was the first sport to have a world championship in 1873. It was the first sport to have a world championship in 1873. Number seven, the heaviest legal ball is 16 pounds. The heaviest legal ball is 16 pounds. Number eight, Brock Lesnar won the Division I National Championship in the year 2000. Brock Lesnar won the Division I National Championship in 2000. Number nine, almost 80% of players will never have a handicap under 18. Almost 80% of players will never have a handicap under 18. Number 10, although it debuted in 1904, it wasn't an official Olympic sport until 1992. And number 11 for two points. This fictional turned real sport once had a game that lasted three months, according to someone named Oliver. What sport is that? Fictional turned real sport once had a game that lasted three months, according to someone named Oliver. Those are your questions on description of sports. We'll be right back 
with the answers after this. Here come them answers on description of sports. You had to name the sport based on the little statement I gave you. Number one, Joe Malone has the most goals scored in a single game. That would be hockey, hockey. Number two, you can smash a shuttlecock, just don't carry it backcourt, badminton, which is a lot of fun on the new uh, Nintendo Switch Sports, badminton. Number three, Globo Jim is really good at this sport, a 2004 comedy film, dodgeball, Ben Stiller taking on the average Joes with Vince Vaughn. Number four, 1986, white balls were changed to yellow tennis balls, so spectators could follow them easier on TV. It was tennis. Number five, Daryl Dawkins shattered a basketball backboard for the first time in 1979, basketball fiberglass. Number six, it was the first sport to have a world championship, 1873, billiards or pool, billiards or pool. Number seven, the heaviest legal ball is 16 pounds. That's in bowling. Also very fun on Switch Sports. Number eight, Brock Lesnar was a wrestler and still is in WWE. Won the Division I National Championship in real wrestling in 2000. Number nine, almost 80% of players will never have a handicap under 18 in golf. Golf. And number 10, although it debuted in 1904, it was an official Olympic sport until 1992. That's baseball. Baseball. And the bonus for two points, the fictional turned real sport once had a game that lasted three months, according to someone named Oliver Quidditch from the world of Harry Potter. And there you have it, a fun episode on descriptions of sports. I wrote uh, another 11 of those for um, my California Knights this week and my East Tennessee Knights this week. So you can play that same style of round with different guesses and different statements about different sports. So that'll be a bunch of fun. Check out all my weekly locations, TriviaWithBuds.com. And if you like that last Harry Potter question, a bunch of Harry Potter questions will be asked at the end of the month in East Tennessee with me. We'll be doing um, a place downtown Elizabethton, outdoors at the Covered Bridge Park. If you're near me in Northeast Tennessee, check that out. That'll be in the evening, early evening, late afternoon on Friday, July 29th, downtown Elizabethton, Tennessee. And then Saturday at 7 p.m., we're doing Team Trivia Harry Potter Edition at State Street Brewing in Bristol, Virginia right uh, over near um, all the fun stuff at the state line and the brand new casino, the Bristol Casino, which is going to be a hard rock in 2024. Check all these things out at TriviaWithBuds.com. Your fact of the day is a bolt of lightning can reach temperatures hotter than the sun. How about that? Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. We'll see you next time for more Trivia with Buds. Cheers. (music) 